that's who it is, okay? Uh, next, I'm going to invite a person. If you look at him, you think about, oh, how I wish to be an entrepreneur. What if I was an entrepreneur? Or, stock market is not a bad thing. <laughs> management skills so normally when we think about skills what do you understand what is skills it's a collar it's a collar which helps us to complete the work in a very short span of time getting my point so first I'll start with a very wonderful question what is the difference between brain and mind do you think it is same? <laughs> Brain is a quantity. Mind is something more than matter. Mind is a quality. So, like product has a quality. Some product are of high quality and low quality. Likewise, our mind is of high quality and low quality. So do you know what is the relationship between mind and our stomach? Both demands food. Yeah. <laughs> Both are hungry. <coughs> stomach demands food. We call it anna, right? Rice, chawal, meat, vegetables. Whatever quality of food we eat, that we become. Likewise, our mind also demands some kind of food. That food is information. So what kind of information we give to our mind that represents us, that makes our image. So today, I'm going to talk about how we can change our life, how we can change ourselves by changing our mind, how to make a quality mind, this is a question. And this relates with the management skills. So whenever we talk about management skills, it is not only about doing MBA, I myself have done MBA, but the life which I have taught me has a value which is greater than IMS, Ahmedabad or IMS Lokma, whatever it is. Because life is a university, it teaches in a very different way. So I've learned that way. So when I talk about you know how to change our mind, I'll talk about 3-8. Have you heard about 3-8 rule? Art. Some of you might have heard in the Facebook also. I am borrowing this information from Andy Ulam. He is in you know, LinkedIn also. You can just follow him. I have read his article. But when I was reading his article, unknowingly I was doing the same. And many of our faculties are doing the same. Many of you might be doing the same. So this 3A tool is all about how to distribute our time. Time is, what do you think, what is time? Scientifically, time is defined in seconds, in minutes, in hours, in days, in months and in years. But if you see, within a year, it is a summation of seconds. How many hundreds of seconds are there in a year? So that is why it's all about taking information. What kind of information we are taking every second, that matters a lot. So that is why, when I'm talking about 3-8, in a day, how many hours are there? 24 hours. So how to divide these 24 hours? So first 8 hours, we need a quality sleep. We need a quality sleep. We need to sleep because we need energy. Some of you might not be sleeping for 3 hours every day because of the you know screen time. We use mobile phones. We see WhatsApp, we see YouTube video, we see different things and what kind of informations our brain is taking, we don't know. And that is hampering our sleep and tomorrow we are not in a full energy. We don't know how to speak, we don't have the ability to think, we are not in a conscious mind. 
because we don't have eight hours quality sleep. The first thing is we need eight hours quality sleep. That is a part of management skill. But some of you might be thinking, I can sleep for six hours. That is fine. If your body demands six hours sleep, that is fine. But ideally, scientifically, eight hours sleep is very much important. Next eight hours is for quality work, quality study, quality listening, quality speaking, quality practicing. So eight hours should be for your quality practice. Next eight hours is for the leisure time. So normally we think about leisure time. For us, leisure time is sleeping. Sleeping is not leisure time. Leisure time is again distributed into three F. Okay. So eight hours should be given to three F. The three F first F belongs to family. Within that eight hours, you give one hour, two hours to your family because of the family you are here. Because of the family I am here. Maybe you are far from your family. You have a mobile phone. Talk with your parents. Tell I love you, mom. I love you, dad. They'll be very happy. But normally we say only to our girlfriends or boyfriends. No, I don't. <laughs> So we need to tell our parents also how much I love you. That love definition is totally different. Another F is what is it? One is family. Another F is friends. Friends. So because of the friends we are here. Okay, we need to give time for our friends also. First is family. Second is friends. What is another F? Yes, future TV. Food. 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 Family, friends. Food. You see, our mind always thinks about food. That it is there. So, we might be thinking, what is there inside the packets? Okay, maybe. I may be thinking, I don't know. <laughs> so, the next F, the next F is faith. 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 Faith for the God, for the Almighty. Or if you are atheist, that is also a faith. If you don't believe in God, if you have different ideology, if you have a different philosophy, spend on that. So eight hours can be distributed for family, friends, and next is three H. This all comes under the leisure time. Eight hours. How can we spend eight hours? Three H. One H is very important. That is health. Very good. We need to spend time for health. Another H is hygiene. Very good hygiene. Clean, neat, and clean. But we normally talk about body hygiene. We take bath, we take shower, we wash our you know, face. But what about the mind? What we need to do for the mind, to clean our mind? Meditation. <laughs> meditation is the mantra to clean our mind. Every day spend some time for meditation. In meditation you don't have to think uh, uh, any God, not necessarily. You don't have to think uh, Siva or Jesus Christ or Allah, you don't have to do that. Meditation is for your time. If you want to think Lord Ganesh, that is fine. If you want to think Lord Jesus, that is fine. If you want to think anybody, that is fine. But meditate. That will cleanse your mind. Next H is hobby. We need to keep hobby. Because when we get old, we don't have that energy. We need to spend quality time. If you want to sketch, Go on, create some arts. If you want to sing a song, sing a song. That is H, hobby. Now see, words. Words are very powerful. Right now I am speaking. My words are traveling in a frequency, entering into your mind. And that is converted into beliefs. So what kind of words you are listening, that is the information. That words might corrupt your mind. And that words, Corrupted words, information, if converts into belief, that is very dangerous. Because you might not know what you are believing. We believe in the value of money. What is money? 
money is just a piece of paper return 10 rupees or 1000 or 500 rupees <coughs> but a word has come from rbi it has value it's a promissory note but it is just a piece of paper because of that word we value that piece of paper we don't value our time so that is why whatever you are believing first you need to understand what word should be entering into your mind that becomes very important so i don't want to take much time okay and uh, see I don't know when I am leaving, like Dr. Promise I have already said, okay, but the time has come and uh, anyway it's not a, a federal party or uh, anything, it's a management skill, you know, lecture course and uh, it's for you, it's for the children and uh, if you follow these rules in your life, okay, so some of you might be thinking, 8 hours is not enough, this morning I was talking with my wife, I'm planning to sp sp speak even on this topic today for my students. My wife was telling, I can't sir, it's not going to work. <laughs> I said, why? Why is it not going to work? And she was saying, my father is a policeman. He used to work for 12 hours. Rat me a phone call aya and he, he needs to go out also. So, so see, 8 plus 8 rule is not rigid. It, should, it needs to be flexible. We are humans. For some, we have a duty of 8 hours. For some, we have a duty of 10 hours. For <coughs> students like you, you have 4 hours class. You can segregate your time accordingly and it's not that you have to sleep for 8 hours. I'm not telling that. Again, students are like, teacher have told me to sleep for 8 hours, okay, so now. <laughs> your parents will scold me again, huh? by what you thought. Huh? <laughs> See, rationality, <coughs> rationality, logic, logical mind becomes very important. Whatever we study, that is just the words. But we need to develop our analytical mind. What I am saying is not easy, it is flexible. I will customize it myself, you customize it yourself. So with this short uh, speech I can say, I am just ending today's speech. Thank you and all the best for your future journey. Thank you so much.